Hey guys, this is Swordfish, and today I'm playing Bastion. Let's find out about the spyglass. We could always see the stars. We just never could reach them, no matter how high we build. Does that let me zoom out further or something? Okay, forge. What can I do? I don't have weapons, these weapons yet. I don't want to upgrade the bow if I'm not using the bow. I want to save my experience just in case. So let's uh, go on to the next level and see what we can see. Another proving ground, okay. Let's ask about That's it. That's Trapper Shingle. Only place in the city to go to get certified with a repeater. And... The Hanging Gardens. Folks used to go here to relax from their relaxing. <laughs> let's do another proving ground. Because why not? I love... I love these. No place I'm better so than Trapper Shingle excited for about learning them. to tread light and shoot straight. Trappers had to tread real careful here, else take a nasty fall. They train themselves by clearing out the targets while not clearing out the floor. Tread lightly. Why am I Any treading? Good trapper knows never to take a step till the time is right. I don't understand the. I don't understand what this has to do with the floor. Or is the floor just falling? Oh, I think the floor is just falling. Okay. And I'm just destroying targets. Um. So what, the goal is to destroy as many targets as you can before you fall? It looks like it's not going to be as easy as it sounded. Ah! Let me roll for a while. Oh, this Expert is the end. Expert trappers got something extra to give them an edge. Oh, I did really well, actually. Okay. Something nasty. Something greasy. 64. Can I do 64? Let me try one more time. Kid now I understand it. Working his aim and footwork on the shingle. I didn't understand exactly what I was doing. Best time to pick a new spot was when swapping magazines. Okay. So really you're supposed to shoot. You shoot until you run out and then you go forward. And then you shoot until you run out. Oh, and I gotta shoot forward. Okay. Oh man, oh man, that was bad. Okay, wait, one more, one more, one more, one more. <clears throat> one more, one more. You gotta, you gotta, um... You gotta shoot at the right. Oh man, that was bad. Gotta shoot the right ones. Make sure I hit the right targets to let myself go forward faster. Forget that one. Do I have to hit all of them? No, no. Okay, it seems like I might have to do all of them to get the... That's 64. That's tricky. All right, we're gonna we're we're gonna not stay there forever. Holding L trigger to lock on targets. That might be the trick. To think a rickety place like the shingle survived and so little else did. Well, oh well. That should give me a bunch of upgrade, more shingle upgrades. Ammo capa... Oh, well, ammo capacity. Okay. Turns out those oh, old no, bones still have some spark in them. 
That That'll fire make rate. those fangs sink in nice and deep. Wait. Now that I upgraded it, wait, let me go back and try it again. Let me try it again. Because the fire rate and the... Yeah, 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 yeah. The fire rate and the, um... And the... Whatever. The upgraded magazine should make it way easier. Theoretically. Well, not not doing the best. My aim isn't great though. Really like shouldn't I be auto aiming? Ah, man. No, it's still hard. Okay, let's. Okay, it's still hard. It's still hard. It's easier, but it's still hard. Gonna have to work on that. Mean whilst let's go. Uh, let's go exploring. Get some more cores. See what we can unlock. Hanging gardens. The dead welcome him with open arms. Oh, jeez. Oh, jeez. Just crushed some dead the people. The calamity took everybody after all. Kids sees a plain, frozen faces all around. You don't much care to see him. Not like this. I, um... Another thing that I love about this game... I love- oh, I thought I could walk on that. Another thing I love about this game so far is how the narrator reacts to your actions. Like, and it sounds so natural, like, when I hit those people, it said, you know, like, and he wasn't so happy to see him or These whatever. folks never saw the calamity coming, but someone did. Someone close. That's just so cool. It just, like, makes- it makes it really feel like... Someone who ain't like Mr. Beckley and his kindly wife. Um, it makes it feel kind of like, I don't know, it's hard to explain, but like, everything... It was someone like him. Like who? Like, oh, he's not dead. It feels kind of like everything you're doing is like predetermined, like, because it's in... Kid sees him there agape, in the flesh. It's a snag or two trying to get oh, to him. Wait, 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 whoa, whoa. Um because it's telling it in, in present. Stop, no matter what. It kind of feels like it's a story. After all. Oh no. Oh this sounds this is gonna be dangerous. Sorry, I just hit my controller on my desk. Um it's it just feels got time for answers. Kind of like it's it's a story that's happened already, which is weird. The Tunda brothers didn't make it. It's weird because when you'd think that in present tense would make it feel more like imminent, and past tense would make it feel more like the past, but for some reason the they present never saw tense. What it was like beyond the walls. The present tense is making Nordy it. Naughty the bird boy. Aww. Didn't make it. That's sad, actually. Um, the present tense kind of makes it feel more like a predetermined kind of... The Jawsons. They didn't make it. Kind of, um... I don't know. I don't know how to explain. Maybe... Grady hope... Senior. Grady Junior. They didn't make it. Maybe you, uh... Maybe one of you guys can understand what I'm saying and but maybe he, explain it better. Survived. Um... But do you know what I mean? Like, do you feel that same feeling? It kind of feels like I'm playing a predetermined story. I mean, obviously. Kid finds okay. proof enough that man ain't from around here. A memento. Insignia born of people by Ura Heritage. Um. Oh, experience rain. Okay. I mean, obviously, I'm playing a predetermined story because it's a video game. But, like. Just think. Without that man, we wouldn't be here right now. 
would we? Um, I don't know. I'm gonna stop trying to explain. Hopefully you understand what I mean. The core survived as well. This is gonna be tough. Or not. Kid does what he has to do. Got it. Um, this seems dangerous. What do you say to a man who's seen too much? Oh, jeez. He's, like, frozen with... Kid he, hasn't a clue. He watched the he world end? This. We Stop. have to go. Please. Oh. Oh, I brought him back. The survivor. He's a proper gentleman, that man. His name is Zolf. No hiding, he's an Ura. Folks like him ain't never been a common sight in Ceylandia. He's relieved to see a living face or two. The kid and I introduce ourselves in kind. Both to him and to each other for the first time. Oh, that's true, actually. Oh, because he was the stranger. Now he's Rux. We fought the Ura decades ago. The Ura. But that was then. Things are different between us now. And then this is Zolf. So we got Rux and Zolf. Let's ask him For about Zolf, these things. Ceylandia was like a second home. He's real worried about his first home, too. Far to the east. Oh, rolling into your legs. We all lost loved ones in the calamity, he says. I don't know how I'm gonna go on without mine. Zolf offers to help me plot the skyways for the kid. At least the calamity hasn't touched the stars, he says. He was born in the Tazzle Terminals. The Ura sent him on a mission of peace to our city, and he's lived here ever since. All right, well, I guess he's gonna help me figure out what happened here. I'm gonna change my weapon to this. I'm feeling that right now, and not the hand grenade. Not feeling the hand grenade. Um, thinking, thinking whirlwind. A yeah. leader goes with a hammer better than a box of nails. Uh, can I upgrade it? I upgraded it already. Here's the bow. Just damage over time. That's good to know. Right, a I'll special surprise in every one of those arrows. <laughs> <laughs> Special surprise. All right, all right. Let's Kid do one more level. Here yet. Oh, I gotta use the. Oh, actually, let's see what we do. What happens here? The cores. They remember. That's why this place is coming together. That's why oh. things are gonna be all right. More spots. Well, let's see what we can do over here. Well, look what we have here. Lost and found. And memorial. Lost and found sounds useful. So does memorial. Lost and found. New items in stock. All right. The lost and found. The kid takes fragments of the old world and makes them whole again. It's a store. The lost and found is actually a really cute name for a store. What are these things? These are skills. Bunch of slashes cut through the toughest armor. Something coarse? Oh, these are upgrades. Nasty, sharp, stringy, heavy. Ragged hood, a memento. What do the mementos do? I don't know, whale ale? Bastion bourbon? Health tonics? Oh, this sounds great. I actually might buy that. Damage when counter blocking and automatically retaliate when injured. That sounds fantastic too. Let's buy this right now. Spend All it. it takes is some fragments, and the Bastion makes it good as new. Restore. I like that kind of idea that everything, you're, you're like, restoring everything. It was already there, and you're bringing it back. I'm going to use Bastion Bourbon here. If you're feeling low, count on the buttery flavor of our own Bastion Bourbon. Yeah, I like that. All right, let's, let's see we what's in the Skyway. We tracked down a couple more cores near the edge of the city. Pith Orchard, Cinderblock Fort. All right, well, let's There's see this. Pith Orchard, built in honor of the bull, 
and folks like Zolf who pray to him. And this one. That cinder brick fort where the marshals used to watch over the city. That's not super helpful. Um, we want to do these proving grounds again at some point, but not yet. Uh, let's do this one. Level up to raise the drink limit. Yeah, that's what I want to do. No use praying to the gods these days. No time for it either. Why am I snoozing? Get up! Kid says a little prayer anyway. Couldn't hurt, right? Yes, orchard. Place is a dead end in more ways than one. The gods oh, ain't geez. gonna catch you if you fall. Now, oh wow. Now, that dialogue was so smooth. Like, it sounded like he meant to say that the whole Folks time. used to make pilgrimage here to pay their respects to Pith, the bull. Did he mean to say that, or did he say that because well, I fell? Well, gods are long gone now, and the orchard core is long gone too. Seems Pith ain't much of a watchdog. Just a bull? Can't hit him, okay. This is Pith, is this like a god? Break his fences. What's this way? Pith stood for something once. Something real. I guess Pith was like a In god. Time, though, the bull stopped being a symbol and started symbol. being decoration. He couldn't even More save his people. loyal subjects. Oh, jeez. This is really dark. Like, the artwork is kind of pretty and beautiful and, like, happy. Bright Pith colors. Makes a decent scarecrow What's down here? Oh, I was hoping they'd reward me for walking down that path. What? Oh. Then Pith lights up. Like what? Rodeo. Okay. Wait, Pith. Yo, Pith. Ain't easy punching through his hide. Ah! Counter. Just Kid just hit breaks him. him to bits. Oh boy. Must have been guarding that shrine. Okay. Let's go in the shrine. So what'll it be? Invoke the gods, or tell them off. Um. In idol, Pith, god of commotion and order, foes shall grow quicker to move and strike. This makes things harder. Oh. Pith. Foes will be stronger. Ten percent experience bonus. I'm down with that. He decides to press his button. Oh jeez. Well, if the gods are alive, they must be plenty sore. Okay, you can reload manually. That was a thing I learned from a tip. And now I've got experience bonuses, and that shrine is probably gonna, um... That's the next thing I can build. Or, the next thing I'm gonna build. Oh, boy. Oh, Kid ain't just never seen away. windbags that quick. Maybe old Pith put a scare in him. I love this machine gun thing now that I've upgraded it a little. Although I wish it was a little more accurate. Oh, there's stuff in the way. Oh no. Come on. Although it's it kind of sprays? I'm not sure why. Not 100% sure why it, it's not. Was that the upgrade that I bought? Because I don't really like that. I want it to shoot straight. Because it's missing all the time. Alright. Come on. Everything is changing and it looks really sweet. Just wanted to mention that. All the colors, and if you haven't noticed, all the colors are changing. It's another bull? Yep. Heal! I like that the game reminds me to heal, that's nice. Ah! Counter? So I'm just... I'm just gonna sit here and he doesn't hurt me when I have my shield up? 
Richard Four. That seems too easy. Oh, what's this way? I never went this way. Flush pit. The gods don't care about trinkets, but the kid ain't no god. That's kind of cute. Uh, get out of my way! All right. Can't get back. The core, yeah. At least he found Zolf's precious shrine. Oh, so that's it. I'm done. Oh, I found Zolf's shrine because yeah, visit the shrine. Okay. So there's a shrine now. Now we can build a shrine of our own. Now we can oh, build I got a shrine. Some alternatives in mind. Or other things. Once I get another core, I assume. So I guess I gotta go off to buy another core, but I'm gonna do that in the next episode. Let me just talk to these guys. Plush Pith. The Ura feared the gods. We turned them into toys. Oh, that's put a little Put their cute. faces on our walls. Zolf doesn't touch the thing. Says the god of commotion is no children's toy. Silly. Silly self. What do you do? Steam bull. Just turns? Turn him round and round all you like. Pith's still gonna be ugly. <laughs> I like him facing that direction. Alright, so that'll be it for this episode. Next episode I'm gonna go hunting for some more cores. So that we can build a shrine and, and unlock some challenges. Uh, maybe buy some stuff here. I don't know. We'll see. Uh, if you like this video, please go down below and give it a like. I would appreciate that uh, very much. And um, if you want to see more videos, go ahead and subscribe. That'll get them sent right to your subscription feed. Just mean swordfish all the time. Um, but regardless, thanks for watching. I appreciate it a lot. you right up. Too bad about the musty aftertaste. I appreciate it a lot. Uh, and I'll see you in the next video. Thank you guys. Bye bye for now.